Hello everyone, welcome to another video from Tech Tuxedo. Today in this video I'm gonna show you how to schedule a job. We are going to use add command, add command to schedule our jobs. Basically add command is used to run a job at a later time or at a time uh, you at a specific time you want a job to run. I will show you how to sh schedule a job using add command and then how to delete it and how to see if it worked or not. Okay, so our command is, is very uh, uh, it's very easy. It's just all you need to do. Basically, um, I would prefer if we create a script in a add command and then run it. So we're gonna create a script. It's a hello script, and what it does it is it just says hello <coughs> on our wall. So I'm if I run this script. this broadcast a hello now I'm gonna schedule schedule it uh, at a later time so it's for s running the job it's, it's F and the script name and then the time when you want to run if you ever want to run it now I'm gonna say now and it runs the job now suppose I want it to run at 1309 so I will say schedule it at 1309 and then in the meanwhile I can see if the job is scheduled ATQ is gonna show me if it's in the queue you can see the job number is 12 it is scheduled to run at 1309 and it's run by root and I'm waiting for my 1309 to happen that's gonna happen in the next 15 minutes basically iPhone F is used to uh, enter a file name over here we have entered our script hello and then the time when we want to run okay and it run at the time we wanted it to run now suppose you want it to run after an hour you're gonna say now plus one hour and if I do ATQ, you're gonna tell me it's gonna run at 14:09, and time right now is 13:09. Similarly, you can you can just put in a very specific time, very specific time of the day, and it's it's a very casual command. If I say run a job at 13:09 on Thursday. Okay, now if I see my ATQ, it's gonna say I'm going to run this on Thursday. So it automatically knows the 13th of April is Thursday. Now, if you suppose if you accidentally run uh, uh, run a command and you want it to delete it, you can use hyphen D option AT hyphen D delete the jobs so over here if I want to delete 14th number of job I'm gonna say 80 heaven D 14 and then it's gonna be only one job that is 13 so guys I hope you enjoyed this video this was all today uh, you can use ATQ command wherever you like I'm gonna do next video on cron jobs and I'm gonna show you how they work it's it's gone and then you can decide if you want to use cron and atq both are very good options but atq is a less preferred one but it's a good one to go thank you have a nice day please like and subscribe to my channel also please put in your comments saying what video should i do next your comments are really valuable thank you